guys, welcome back to some more Vitamin Y. So today is Wednesday, and that means that we are using, oh wow, I'm just typed in Vitamin Y. Uh, you both sees. So, I am sick. I'm sick again. Ah, uh, hate being sick. Ugh. Ah, it's sort of a guy. Like, I feel like whenever I get sick, the quality of my videos just, just dwindles because I'm so sick. But, yes, once again, I, uh, caught another cold. This one was like an overnight cold. Like, literally, I was fine. Going to sleep, like, went to bed, I was feeling fine, woke up, and I just felt like shit, so, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I noticed this, um, uh, Tuesday morning that I was sick, that, uh, I was catching on to something, so, you know, you know, when you get, like, a sore throat, and your nose is stuffed up, and, you know, when I, you know, feel like that, and I'm like, oh, I'm getting, I'm getting sick, it might be early stages, and, you know, try to nip it in the butt real quick, and, you know, take some medicine real quick, so, um, you know, you generally have record a day ahead, but this is actually, okay, apparently this person, you know, wants to duel, accepts the duel, and then doesn't use pit boxes or anything like that. Uh, usually I would record a day ahead, but, oh my god, oh my god, I can't, I can't even type right now. <laughs> uh, but I, I was super, dude, like, no, dude, if you're not gonna fucking accept my duel, then... No, we're not gonna duel, because, uh, like I said, I just tried to duel you, I did pit boxes, you didn't do it, so no. So, I said I usually would record videos ahead, of, like a day ahead, but I was so out of it. Literally, I just ate some chicken noodle soup, took some medicine, and tried to lay down. Like, I literally went to bed at, like, 7 o'clock. So, but just because I'm sick, you know, I uh, gotta do my obligation to you guys, of course, you know. That is the one thing that, <laughs> that I definitely say is uh, wrong with me is that, you know, I try to give it my all when it comes to this YouTube channel, you know. And even if my heart, <laughs> even if my health depletes, I will still try to, you know, give it my all. So, you know, um, it's actually 5 o'clock in the morning right now. 5 o'clock Wednesday morning. And what, and hold and behold, what am I doing right now? Sitting here recording videos, so. <sighs> anyway, uh, so you both see this, of course. Uh, so, I tried to work on this deck. I, you know, sick, but I tried to work on this deck, tried to get it, um... Uh, see if there's anything that that need to be fixed or adjusted in it, and uh, I just couldn't find anything. There was just, you know, I just I couldn't see it. You know, main deck wise, the deck is fine. You know, um, you know, one of the major weaknesses of the deck is of course getting hit with a uh, back row, and uh, there's not much I can do about that, of course, because this deck has to have a lot of revival. The revival is the key, is the pinnacle points of this deck. So, uh, you know, I can't, I can't not not have that. Alright, that's fine. I'll go ahead and take the 300. So, uh, extra deck wise, put in some new people, took out some synchros just because I didn't synchro summon as much. Like, I generally don't synchro. I, like, if I'm synchro summoning with Mass Chameleon in my target, then I'm not doing it right. I should be going to Xyz, to give out Xyz. So, uh, Goyo Guardian just because I have, um, uh, um, Kirk. I, I mean, oh my god, what the fuck is his name? Krebens. Krebens, you know, block and attack, summon level 4, Synchron, and Goyo Guardian. He's like the best 8 right now. Um, Armades, because Mask Million and level Eater. And then I put in some more uh, rank 10, so we got this guy. Uh, 61, I need to talk about him on uh, card review. And then, because sometimes I can go to Super Chocolate Fudge Cover, but I can also go into Utopic Dragon. And if I go into some Utopic Dragon, like, that would just be awesome. So, you know, you can just wreck him up off Utopia, but I can just do 3 level 10s and then, you know, uh, uh, you know, just be like, all right, I'm so awesome. <laughs> I'm a 4,000 beater, and if you try to target me by a monster effect, I'm attacking same material, and then, yeah, I negate it and destroy it, so, yeah. So, if I can summon that Utopic Dragon, you know, Utopia's, like, strongest form, like, Utopia, that, now that's too strong. 4,000 beater, I can't be targeted by opponent's monster effect. Like, oh, you want to make that one-to-one? -one? No, I don't think so. <sighs> Oh, butt scraper, sure. So you're using a hero deck and I'm using a Ubel deck, so this should be interesting. Oh shit. Bitch genetics. Oh no, bitch genetics, alright. Well, when she attacks, she's twenty two. She's not just twenty two. No, it doesn't work like that. She's only twenty two when you attack me. Alright. Do, 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 do. I have plays. I'm just trying to think what route I want to go down with my plays. Mm. 
Uh, I think I'm just gonna summon Masculine and Masculine and bring back Ebel. Let's chill. So, uh, despite being uh, 5 o'clock in the morning, I actually woke up a while. Or I had a terrible, terrible time sleeping. Like, it, like, laying down for some odd reason just made me so nauseous. So nauseous. Like, it made me feel like I wanted to throw up. Like, and I, and I felt dizzy and sick and just, oh my god, like, terrible. So, uh, you take 400 and you're destroyed. Unless you don't know how Skyscraper works. <sighs> Skies, oh my god, I, uh, Skype, Skype Scraper, Skype Scraper, guys, Skies. Scraper only works when you attack me. <coughs> so, you know, I actually woke up a lot early. I think I got up, I think I woke up at 2. And then I was like, well, you know what? I'm going to do some extra credit work for my education class. So, literally, uh... After all, turning on my summons, uh, I have a C in the class. But you, can, like I said, his curve is really weird. Like your grade can't go down; it can only go up. So, you know, you get points for everything you do. So if you fail, if you don't do well, you get zero points added to your grade. But you do, you know, you only add points. So you know, there is no like, oh well, I have a ninety in the class, but I got like an eighty percent of my final, so my grade dropped. No, not in his class. So you only get points. So. And up the point system currently, I have 56 points. 56 points is a C. So he offers extra credit assignments. You do take these like these little online classes, and you get one extra credit point per class. So literally waking up at two o'clock in the morning, I decided to go ahead and bust out a whole bunch of these. A whole bunch of these. I literally had the fat stack right here. I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. That's eight extra credit points. And if you guys remember, I was actually talking about this on Daily Duels, that uh, literally I had an F in the class, turned it into two assignments, got eight points, and boosted my grade up uh, to a C. So literally, through these assignments that I'm, I mean, these extra credit assignments, I literally, I'm literally going to go from a C to an A. Not even including, uh, that is only when you're, okay. Yeah. I'm literally gonna go from a C to an A, not including the final. Literally, I could flunk the final and still get an A in the class, cause that's just the way he curves his class. So, um, I think I want to go ahead and go for someone interesting, who I don't go for very often, but when he does get summoned, it's fun. So I think I'll go ahead and do that. I'm gonna summon Armageddon Knight. Armageddon Knight effect. I'm gonna go ahead and drop low leader. So like I said, there's a pretty good chance that this deck is the one that's gonna be staying over you, and Zector. So I'm trying to get it the best that it can be, and you know, like I said it, it looks level Easter. Oh my god, I'm so sick and so out of it. Level E, uh, I can't type. I can't either. Effect. Go ahead and summon you back. Uh, that's good. Like all oh, nine. Yep. Did you guys guess who we're going for? Someone who we don't go for that often, but I know you guys love them. Yeah, Heart Earth. Heart Earth too strong. Alright. Heart Earth attack. You take 2100. You know, and I got the and I got the Lumen Reverse to make sure my plays are safe. <coughs> uh, so uh, if I have time, I might bust out some extra, some a little bit more extra credit assignments. I don't really like just you know, like just service learning ones like uh, overcoming procrastination, time management, uh, taking quest uh, quizzes online, how to stay motivated online, uh, effectively communicating online, uh, ten tips for successful in online courses, uh, mastering a job interview, exploring and uh, choosing a, a major. Uh, heart, earth, oh, fat. So, 
So, yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, he thought it would be, you know, effective to go ahead and learn these courses and stuff, so. <sighs> so, that's fun. Like I said, lots of extra credit. I still got a whole bunch more I could do. Like, literally, literally, there's so much extra credit. I think there's 32 extra credit. There's literally so much extra credit, you can literally take your grade from an F to an A. That is how much there's extra fucking credit. Like, ridiculous, ridiculous. But to him, you know, no. You take 2100. Heart, Earth, oh my god, effect, read my card. You're not destroyed. Just read, read. It's not that hard. Go. All you have to do is just read my fucking cards and you'd be so chill, but instead you decide not to read and now you're looking like a fucking idiot. I just wanted to go into hard earth just to go into hard earth. Probably wasn't the best of choice, especially with 101, because he could just easily go into 101 right now, but yeah, it's not very often. People just love you, Boxies, I swear. I don't even care if you're in defense. Like, that that's what's up right now. I don't even give a shit. Like, Hard Earth doesn't give a shit whether you're in defense or not. I need some more Galaxy Queen lights. Like, I feel like that's maybe what we're missing. More level modulation, but I don't think there's anything else we can run. I'm gonna kill. I'm gonna kill Gold. Should I kill Gold? I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill him. I'm kinda worried about him. Take another tone one. Still not destroyed. I don't even know why you keep on trying to fucking kill him. Still not destroyed. Oh my god. I'm totally out of it. Like you guys. <sighs> now I'm gonna kill him. Mm -hmm. I don't like how this effect is only during the end phase. You know, there's a lot that can happen between you know your opponent's you know uh, draw phase and end phase. Uh, that's, the effect's not the best, but I just like something harder because it's really cool and unique. Yeah, you know, it's not a, it's not a monster that you see every day, so. Excuse me. Well, if I draw another Galaxy Queen's Light, you know, I guess one of the things that sucks is a uh, Galaxy Wizard, you know. Another Dark Graffer. Alright. I'll just summon a Nixie. Because you both sees is you both sees, because I see in you both sees. Set. Attach, go ahead and get me another nice chameleon. Uh, attack, we take 800. And then I'll go ahead and kill the clay man. The claymation man. Go ahead. Ah, like I said, I hate getting sick, especially on YouTube, because you guys know that, some of you guys I know who have been with me when times I do get sick. I don't get sick very often, but what I do, the quality of the video super drops, so hopefully I can, you know, cure this cold real quick. You know, especially at the end of the semester with finals and everything, and I get sick, like, awesome. You know, and there's also another struggle that I'm going to be experiencing, but I'll go into more detail about that in, um, in, uh, the duels. What a fact. No. <laughs> Read your cards. Oh my god. You don't, look, you must control no other cards and have no cards in your hand to resolve this effect. Like, you didn't even read that second half. You're just like, when this card summon, I get to draw two cards? Oh yeah! Like, oh, 
No. No. Bubble Man would be banned if he, that was his effect. He would be fucking banned. I shit you not, he would be a pot of greed on legs. Like, if this commander is banned, he would definitely be banned. Like, no, 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 no. When this card is summoned, draw two cards. Be like, Psh, fucking summon a monk, pitch a spell, summon Bubble Man, draw two, exit. You're like, no, 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 no. He would be banned. Seriously? Seriously, you need to read. Oh my god. <laughs> like, nigga. It's not Bubble Man's effect. Put one more back. <laughs> you ain't just fucking jumping to conclusions and shit. <laughs> and like, that's what Bubble Man does. <laughs> like, no, Bubble Man would be so fucking broke. <laughs> Sick and tired of telling you fucking shit. Heart. Oh. Earth. Effect. Put you on the graveyard. Vanish. Alright, this is game. Call the hunted. Alright. Set that. Uh. King effect. Go ahead and give me my last mass chameleon, which I can summon. Because I can. <laughs> summon you. Your effect. Summon you. Is there any other seas that we want to go to just to end this? No, we're good. If we had more Galaxy Queen's lights. Let's see, what was that other card that was like Galaxy Queen's Light? We might put that back in the deck. Like the one where I target a monster with zero attack or defense and I put all the levels the same again. We might put that card back in the deck because it seems like I can get the setup and it seems like I can get, you know, all that. But the problem that I'm missing is that I don't have the level modulations for you, Galaxy. So it seems like more level modulations would be appropriate for the deck. So we'll go ahead and uh, address that accordingly. So... Uh, anyway, uh, Ubox see you, so, like I said, there's a pretty good chance that this deck will be sent on a lot of people like Ubox see you, so, uh, you know, like I said, we got, uh, you know, uh, about one more week to, before we decide, like I said, but it seems like Ubox see is gonna be the one to stay, so, I guess not, this upcoming Saturday will be Ubox Injectors, and I guess next Saturday Ubox Injectors will get taken off, and deck profile, of course, and, uh, Zombie Vice, so it'll be Super Vice and Zombie Vice right next to each other, so that might be kind of cool. Alright, so I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of I'm Aware. At least, like I said, I apologize for being sick. There's not much I can do about it, but like I said, the, the quality of my videos dwindles. Like, I'm not enthusiastic, I'm coughing, I'm, you know, I'm not as, uh, I have as much energy, so yeah. Alright, but still, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with Cosmic Cubo. Alright, thanks for watching.